Hi everyone! Happy National Poetry Month! I've really been enjoying listening to a poem a day read by some of our friends, booktubers, bloggers, authors. It's been really fun to see the poems that touch people or have meaning to people for some reason. Um, it's actually also been a really nice way to celebrate April because we haven't been having the best weather here in Connecticut. It's actually quite stormy today, so um, I thought I'd read a poem to cheer me up. Um, this is from a collection, see if I can get this, beautiful cover. It's called No Matter the Wreckage, Poems by Sarah Kay. Sarah Kay has a really cool TED Talk you can look up. Um, it's very inspiring. She does a lot of spoken word poetry, and then she talks about uh, the meaning of poetry in her life. And um, I bought this when I went to Portland, Maine, probably about a year ago now, and went to got a chance to go to Print, which is a very cool bookstore that opened a few years ago there. And I haven't been reading it, you know, cover to cover. I've just been picking the book up and seeing where it opens and enjoying a poem. And I've really loved every poem that I've read. This one is entitled Grace. I woke up this morning and said thank you to the ceiling, the bed sheets, the mirror, the windows, to whomever was listening, for the softly swaying hammock, the salt air, the clouds that rolled in while I wasn't watching, the sounds of someone starting a fire nearby, the smell of a man's body, the sound of his sleepy baritone, from within the chest I pressed my head against, the way his heart beat out of time with his quiet singing, and his breath came out of time with both, for the damp grass below us, and the swinging door of the outdoor shower, for the goosebumps on his skin, from the darkling evening, for his patient arms around me, and the weight of him against me, and for the softly swaying hammock, somehow large enough to carry all of this. I just love that poem. So keep reading poetry. It's worth it. Bye.